guys have requested um, kid-friendly, easy recipes where you don't feel like cooking, and I think this would be perfect. I get two slices of bread mm -hmm. and one piece of cheese and mm -hmm. squish it so it can fit mm -hmm. in the toaster. Right. And I put it in the toaster and activate it <laughs> and once it pops up then it will look like a toast but it's a grilled cheese. I have a couple variations um, and a play on his cheese toaster sandwich that you guys might find helpful for snacks, treats, or lunch or dinner or when you're hungry. Here we go. Okay, so per the kiddos instructions, I'm going to take two slices of bread. The only thing I'm doing differently is I'm cutting off the crust, but when he makes the sandwich, he uses all of the bread and save the crust for breadcrumbs later. So I'm going to take a slice of cheese and I'm sort of going to fold the edges just to make sure that it stays in the bread before I put it in the toaster. Now I'm going to top it with the other slice of bread. I'm going to give it a firm press and take my fork and press and crimp the edges so it stays enclosed. Now, Dax typically likes to use his hands and just gives it a really firm mash, which totally works, but I think using the fork works as well. So into the toaster, and I have my toaster setting on somewhere between two to three on my, my knob here. So this is where I want it to be, and I'm going to show you. It comes out so melty and cheesy. Now aside from it being grilled cheese and not having butter on it, this is a pretty easy snack for a kid to make. Okay, so toaster sandwich number two. Here I have my crustless slices of bread. I'm going to add some mozzarella cheese, some chopped turkey pepperoni, I'm gonna to top it with more of the cheese, add the other slice of bread, give it a good smash, and the same thing. I'm gonna take my fork and crimp the edges to seal it shut, and then into the toaster. As easy as that. I'm also going to serve this with store-bought pizza sauce for dunking, and this is a nice lunch for a kid to make. So for this next one, this is for a sweet dessert treat type toaster sandwich. Here I'm taking mini marshmallows, I'm going to add some mini chocolate chips. I'm going to cover it with the bread and the same process. Give it a smash, crimp the edges with a fork, into the toaster, and you've got a sweet treat that a kid can make all on his own. Hope you give these recipes a try and I hope you like it. Thanks for watching. Bye!